Fantastic Five. Hi guys, Spitfire here with Game Mode 5, and uh, what, you, what you saw was uh, actually me doing my impression of uh, Doug Nixon and, uh, and all of his awesomeness. You guys should definitely check him out. There's a link to his channel. BAM! Right there. I should get a sound, a sound effect for when I go BAM! BAM! BOOM! 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 I don't know. BAM! Kablooey! BAM! Kapow! BAM! BAM! Anyways. All right, so guys, lots going on. Been going on this week, uh, namely, um, let's see. I uh, reviewed this game. Well, it's more of a first look type thing uh, called Shatter. Now, Shatter is an uh, it's an indie block breaking game. Uh, it's very reminiscent of uh, say Space Invaders. A couple other things. It's really cool. Um, you guys should definitely check that out. It's available on Steam, and it doesn't cost that much. Um, all right. Also. I uh, did a video for Envious Host, uh, who's been very gracious enough to allow us to um, to do that. Um, also, let's see, um, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. we did two how-to videos. We're probably going to be doing a few more of these, and I really hope that uh, we do, uh, because it, they're insanely fun to do, even though I'm all, now click here, now click there. Close this window. Uh, these two actually were on uh, single player commands, how to install that for all versions. Now, some people pointed out that um, when I say all versions, it's not necessarily true uh, because it hasn't updated for 1.4 yet. However, don't let that bother you because very shortly it will be updating and those same instructions still apply. All right. Now, there's also uh, the Team Fortress 2 mod. Did that just the other day. Uh, that one is freaking... Awesome! We did three episodes of uh, Adventure Tech. Now that's freaking awesome. Captain Rob was in one of them. Did a couple, you know, things on our own. Um, we also saw our first uh, uh, first visit from Pimp Shizzle. Pimp Shizzle. Um, so I don't know if we're gonna be seeing him again. You might wanna let me know in the comments whether you wanna see him or maybe some of his friends later on. That's freaking awesome. Now that brings us to the next big news. Next big news is Aegis came out with their launcher, so you guys can play Adventure Tech now too. Not only with it with in single player, you can also join the multiplayer server as it comes bundled with it. My fans are not nut jobs. That's right. Already has a server right there inside of it. Just Adventure Tech till your heart explodes. In your face. Now, the big, big news. The big news that's been going around the community and it's not getting the uh, attention that it deserves. The Aether team actually came out with a ridiculous announcement. The fact that they are still working on the Aether 2 and that the project's not dead. And they're making progress. They're actually looking to release when it's bug-free-ish, whatever that means. I don't know. There should be a link down in the description down below to their Facebook page. Definitely go there. Give them a like. Let them know what you think. And, you know, just don't do what everybody does and bother them and go, when's it coming out? When's it gonna, you know, when are you gonna release for 1.4? Seriously, that's annoying. Star Wars The Old Republic is going free to play. Yes. Now, uh, free to play, if you're not uh, um, familiar with it, means that you can play the game for free, totally free, but you can buy little add-ons and things like that to help support the game and to be awesome in game. Um, for instance, League of Legends, Riot Games did this with skins and uh, these little point things. Do you guys play League of Legends? If you do, let me know in the comments down below, because I, I was actually thinking about doing some videos with League of Legends. Anyway, moving on along, um, there's also another really cool game that uh, everybody needs to know about. Ah, Battlefield 1942. Yes, is going free to play as well very, very soon. Um, I don't know if you guys really know anything about that game. Uh, it's on Origin. It's not on Steam. Um, Origin is kind of like Steam's derpy little brother. D all right, also, um, back to our first thing. Doug Nixon gave me a shout-out this week, and he's all like, You should check out Spitfire and stuff. And so, yeah, that's actually the reason for the uh, the thing that we did there at the beginning. 
uh, is because I really felt that it was uh, really cool to uh, go ahead and give him a shout out back again there should be another link BAM right there um, if you guys would check him out uh, he's got this whole like Minecraft ninja thing going on and he's like don't mess with him seriously he'll go all ninja time on your ears alright guys I can't really think of too much else that's been going on um, not anything I can talk about really um, there's definitely some stuff in the pipeline stuff I got coming down I'm not really able to talk about right now because um, it might ruin the surprise but definitely keep your eye on the channel I will keep you guys filled in until next time, I'm Spitfire with Game Mode 5. Like, subscribe, comments, please. Hey, honey, how did that sound? Doug does it better. D